Uh, zombie virus for a fiver, don't mind if I do. Oh, you know it's based on zombie versus ambulance, it's based on what? Zombie versus ambulance? That sounds fucking mental. This game must be crap, right? Wrong. No crap. This game's like Crazy Taxi. Imagine Crazy Taxi if it was slow, right? And if you were picking up survivors, and if your vehicle crawled, and if the town was populated by zombies, and everything was very slow paced and full of dread, and there were timers everywhere, and when you picked up passengers, timers were counting down to when they turned into zombies, right? And there was a wee hospital sign up in the corner that shows you morale dropping at the hospital as they start to flip out because the zombies are out there, all right? And you've suddenly got this weird game that's kind of fun, but it's full of kind of foreboding as well, right? You're a wee bit kind of worried when you're playing it, but you're kind of enjoying yourself because you can soup up your ambulance and get like big spikes and all that, that kind of stuff. All the weaponry that ice cream vans in Glasgow have, do you know what I mean? Zombie vs Ambulance contains two of my least favourite things, right? I don't like ambulances because I'm a hypochondriac, and I don't like zombies because I'm scared of zombies, right? But it has the risk-reward thing happening, right? That thing that makes many simple games work so well, risk-reward. You're out in your truck, you think, I think I'll go for an extra survivor so that I can soup up my van, and you get yourself in the shit. And that's where the thrill comes from. For the price, this is 